my phone. Hopefully it's not lying to me. And let's just kind of fix this a little, little bit. A little bit. Looks okay? All right, if we're crooked, please let me know. All right, you guys, how are my favorite humans today? Hope you guys are doing great. It's been a long day. And for me, it has been. How about for you? I'm not sure, is it morning? Is it nighttime? What time is it for you guys? Let me know down in the comments below. That's where the comments go. Have you subscribed yet? You really should, because guess what we got today? We got a very underrated brand, if I may say so myself. I feel like this brand does not get enough love that she should get because she's just, she's amazing. Let's just be honest. She's amazing, she's awesome, and I love everything by her. She don't know me, she never knows me. Maybe one day she will, I have goals. Hashtag Vanessa Myrick goals for me. I'll meet her one day. Hi, Rochelle, how are you? Always so sweet with the thumbs up. I appreciate you, girl. Hope you're having a good night or morning, wherever you are. Um, we got Vanessa. So we're gonna go ahead and review it. We're gonna try not to keep it long. We're gonna try not to. We're gonna try to keep it short. Does that make sense? I'm already starting off weird. That's what I do. So, oh, Rochelle said something I didn't see her. Hi, Jocelyn. So glad you made it in, sweetie. I'm finally here. I know, two hours later, I'm finally here. So what do we have here? What do we have here? Do we have cat hair on you already? I haven't even opened you up yet. Nothing sacred. Nothing is sacred in this room. Cat hair everywhere. Uh, but despite that, just kind of dust it off a little bit. We've got Danessa right here. This is her Lightwork 3 palette. And um, it's pretty amazing. Have I opened it yet? No. But I know it's pretty amazing because Danessa just does amazing things. She is an artist's dream, okay? No joke. If you love artistry, if you love, you know, creativity, that's me right here. Anything to do with, you know, your makeup or even not makeup, maybe just painting itself. This girl has got your back, okay? Hi, Nelly. How are you? Nelly, you weren't first. What happened? You're slacking on me. We'll talk later. Okay. So anyway, Danessa just, she has a way of, she's so innovative. She, she's just, she's a lovely human being. Again, I don't know her, but I watch a lot of her. I do. She just, you know, she just oozes creativity and, and just strength and just embodies everything that I wish I could be. So I love her products. I love everything about her. And there's nothing that I've tried by this brand that I don't like yet. Now I am honest. I'm always going to be honest. So if I do come across a product that I don't like, even though I love Danessa, you know, she's She's my girl, even though I will still be honest. So I have not touched this yet. How? I don't know. How have I kept my hands off of this? I don't know. But um, I received it in the mail, and we're going to go at it. Nelly, you're sorry because you're not being... Feeling... Oh, Nelly, I feel you, girl. I'm right here with you. I understand. I'm just picking on you. So don't get sad. It's a joke. Okay, all right. So we're going to open this up, and we don't know exactly what she looks like yet. Oh, we've got some paper. We've got some paper. Lovely. And we've got a mirror. You know how I am. What do I say? A mirror is half the battle. You got a mirror. It's your, your game to lose. Okay, I'm already happy with you. So we're going to drop that on the floor as we do. We have a nice little protectant right here with her nice little logo on there. Her DM for Vanessa Den Myricks. Put that on the side. And here is the palette. Let's hold it this way so this way you don't get all of, all of double me, you know, with the mirror. So let's hold it this way. Just look at this, you guys. Just take a good a good gander at this okay this just looks amazing i mean i hope it works amazing but it just looks amazing just see how these these shadows just kind of glisten in the light and they kind of you know shift a little bit when you're going back and forth let's try them on the eyes let's do that so i do know that there's supposed to be two cream to powder ones and that's going to be these two right here that's going to be ignore my nails for some reason, nail polish refuses to stay on my nails anymore. I don't know if they're on strike. What, what is, what's wrong with you guys? I haven't got them done lately, so they're just hating me. And no polish will stay on them. This is three days of polish. It's already coming off. So ignore that. So I'm sorry. Just realized it right now in the, in the viewfinder thing. But this is supposed to be a cream, and this is supposed to be a cream. These are all highlights right here. And they do have a little bit of a different undertone. So I believe one is like a purpley... One is supposed to be like a pinky, one's supposed to be like a green, and maybe not pinky, maybe more bluey. Okay, is that a word? It is today. It is today. So I can see it when I hold it to the side, but I don't think you're going to be able to see it. But I will point them out. So let's see here. Let's get a good gander at it. Okay, this one has the greenish kind of shift under it. 
I don't think you're gonna be able to, can you kind of tell right there? See how it kind of leans a little greenish in there? This one has like a little bit of a bluish undertone to me. And this one has a little bit of that like purplish kind of pinkish undertone there. And this one seems like to be maybe a true just white type of cream kind of. So if you kind of look at them just slightly like that, you can see the shift of color. They're just highlighters, you guys. Now you can use those anywhere you want on the face. You can put it on your eyes, you can put it on your lips, do whatever you want. It's the world is your oyster, okay? Do what you like. Now I'm gonna swatch these for you. I think the fastest thing for me to do is to just kind of pop them on the arm and then tell you what colors they are, okay? I'm gonna do that. And I tried to have a clean arm for you guys. I tried, I didn't, uh, I didn't lotion it, but um, it might be, there might be a few little nomad hairs on there. There might be, because I'm not perfect. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna start with the top row and I'm gonna, okay, that is, that's fully a cream. So the Polaris, that's fully a cream. And just, just look at this. Just, just, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you just, you just can't, there's no words. So I'm gonna start kind of like right here. This is Polaris. Next one's gonna be Galaxy. Now Galaxy also, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, look at my dehydrated finger. It makes my finger look plump, even though it's not. Just, are we looking at this? I'm not flicking you off, I swear. But that's just beautiful. That's Galaxy. And that feels creamy as well. The first one, Polaris, is really like an actual cream. And this one is not the Galaxy, but it feels like it. Uh, next one is Martian. They all feel so good. I mean, no lie. What is this, this sorcery in here? Look at this. Look at these colors. Jeez. I could only strive to be this good. You know what I'm saying? There's that one. Then we have Sol. Almost named my daughter Sol. I almost did. It was going to be Solana, and then we're going to call her Soul for short. And my husband said, no, to hell with that. I don't like that name. I said, okay, fine. Calm down. We'll name her Sienna. All right. So here's this one right here, Soul. And then I'm going to use this guy. Okay, I'm going to use this guy. And we're going to get Orion. Now, Orion's supposed to be like a glitter, you know, like a full-on glitter. And you can feel him. He's, he's glittery. So he's not going to have like a super awesome swatch, but we're still going to put him on there. And so there's a swatch right there because it's just a glitter. So he's not going to go perfectly across. But just, I love the tones. You know what I'm saying? They're, they're speaking to me. And I'm not really a blue kind of gal. I mean, I like me some turquoise, but you know, that has like some green in it. But this is just speaking to me, my language. And we all know my language is a little weird. We all know. So that's the top row. Now let me get to the bottom row. And we're going to start with space suit. Well, I didn't do a very good job getting this off my fingers, did I? <laughs> We're live, so that's wonderful. It really is. Probably should have made like a dedicated video, not live with this one, but I couldn't wait. So we're doing it now. Space suit, again, super creamy. This just feels like you're putting your hand in cream. Okay, so that's weird because it looks orange, like full on orange. And now that I'm putting it on the skin, it's it's got a, a gold, like a yellow gold, shift you can't, can't even see it you guys take a good look and look at it when i turn it has this yellow go i'm trying to break my arm just break the arm i mean my thumb's broken just break the arm but you can't really tell but it has this really yellowy when i'm looking at it like this i'm looking at like a greenish gold color don't ask me how she does this magic i don't know but it's beautiful uh next one's gonna be aurora we love those don't we we love those names beautiful just <sighs> okay didn't I say I was, gonna, I was gonna do this fast? I lied. Wow, look at that swatch. That is like, bam. Okay, I'm gonna love that color. Uh, next one is Gaia. These all feel very creamy, okay? So they just, they all feel creamy. Only one that doesn't feel creamy is this guy right here. He feels glittery, as he should. He's a glitter. Let him live. So there's Gaia right there. And then, I don't know why this bottom row is swatching like really heavy. No complaints here. I'm so happy. Next one is Solar Rain. Solar Rain. Just look at it. It's like a solar. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't gone to space. But I think it's like a solar. Yeah, okay. Astronaut vibes. Here we go. Solar Rain. And that has another shift. These all have a very crazy shift. When you're looking at them like dead on this way, they look a very different color than they do in here. Okay? So in here and in there, it's very different. Just so you know. All right, next, but last but not least, is gonna be Black Hole. Mm-hmm, Black Hole, we did that, we did. And there it is right there, it's dark, oh yeah. What's, that's a Black Hole, all right. Could say so many things right now, but I'm not going to. 
All right, and it's like a charcoal-y kind of color. How did that end up so weird on my arm? Who knows, but there we go. Super duper dark. All right, you guys. Now, I'm not gonna swatch the highlights because I don't feel I'm gonna do them justice with, with this, but, or I can go with this hand, but this hand don't work so well. So what to do? What's a girl to do? I don't know. I'm live, I'm trying to wing it. You know what I'm saying? So as I ruin my pajamas, I'm just, you know, trying to get this off my fingers. It's a good time over here in the house of cat. Maybe, you know what, I think I can. I, th I think I can do it. I'm the engine that could, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go ahead and, so these don't feel as creamy as all of these, okay? These have more of a, just a different feel to them. Almost like a little, a little bit of like a fine, fine sand. Very like a fine, fine sand, like finely milled sand. Does that make sense? I hope so. There's that first one right there. That one's gonna be Blue Moon. Oh, see, that's why I had a little bit of a bluey undertone. I told you. So let's swatch him right here. Very bam in your face. Very bam in your face. If I wasn't in your face earlier, I'm there now. Okay, just love me. Just love me and just take me as I am. Uh, next one is Spring Equinox. Yes, and that's the one with, I think, the greenish type of undertone to it. And again, you guys, you just can't see it. You can't see it the way you should be able to see it. But I don't know if it's the lights, but in here, you can see the green shift to it. So there it is right there. Can't, I'm not sure, you just can't see it. You just, you can't, you can't see it. But look, here's an example. Look at this guy right here. You see this little shift right here? See that? That's what I'm talking about. It looks blue and then it kind of goes to a copper. They all do that, it seems like. They're amazing. She's, she's such a smart woman. Then we have Strawberry Moon. That's gonna be the one with the pinky, pinky undertone to it. Ooh, that one's pretty. That's gonna be a really pretty highlight on the eyes. I'm looking at these like to use on the eyes. I don't really need that kind of bam in your face on my, what do we call this? What do we call this right here? What is this? Cheekbones, that's what they are. I don't really need the bam in your face on the cheekbones. Um, I would like to put it like probably the center of the eye or the inner corner of the eye or maybe top on the lips. That's what I probably use it for. Um, maybe very slightly I might use this one, mm, you know, like over here, but that's not like my go-to thing. I like a, a subtle, like what I got going on right now. What I have going on right now, I know you're asking me, you probably weren't, but you are, okay, is her um, Danessa Myrick's Vision Flush. This is in Tiara, and that's what I have right here. It gives a little subtle, subtle glow. That's what I like. And then her her uh, Vision Flush blush in, um, what are you guys? Bread and Butter, right? Yeah, Bread and Butter is this color right here. So the glow is from the Tiara, and the Bread and Butter is like the um, the blush. You see it, you know what I'm saying, okay? All right, now the last but not least is Golden Eclipse. This is the one that I said looked like a true kind of white creamy. And yeah, I don't see any shifting from here right now. So let's pop him on right there. There we go. And that's all of them, you guys. That is her Light Work Palette Volume 3, okay? Beautiful, stunning. I wish I didn't put this one so high up here. Let's try to rectify that for you right now. Yeah, using big words today. Try to rectify that. There we go. That is the um, black hole. <laughs> I love the name she gave them. But there we go, you guys. Beautiful, very unique, very shifty, very, very Danessa. Everything Danessa puts out has a vibe. She's a vibing kind of gal. All right, so let's do something on the face real quick. We've been talking for 13 minutes. How do I do that? How do I go so long and I feel like I'm not saying that much? That's my life. I say a lot about nothing. All right, so everybody on Instagram has been, she's a big hit on Instagram. Everybody on Instagram has been uh, doing looks, all kinds of looks. And I really don't know how to stand apart from them right now because they've all been kind of doing everything under the sun. So I'm really not gonna be able to do anything any different. You know, if you've seen it on Instagram, I'm probably not gonna be able to do any different than what you've seen already. All I'm doing right now is just kind of patting down the um, concealer that I have on here just so it does not interfere with this beautiful palette because you want to give it a good review. All right, make sure we don't have no creases in there, yeah, on these little wrinkly lids. I know, I know. I'm trying to do you right, Danessa. I'm trying my best. But I hope you guys got some of her products during the sale. Um, you know, don't sleep on her. She is amazing. She is so humble, and yet I feel like she should be 
much more popular than what she is. But she's in Sephora now, so that's like a big hit. You get to Sephora, you've like made it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, one day I'll be there, Sephora. One day I'll be there. All right, you guys, what should we do here? What should we do? I have, I try to stay neutral on the lips, but I kind of messed up with the cheeks because I went a little bit too, uh, too pinky, a little too pinky. So mm -mm -mm, I want to say I want to look into the purple, but that blue, these blues right here, this and this is just kind of like calling me by my name. I mean, they're saying, cat, use me. And I'm like, well, maybe not today. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of go into this this and this i think i'm gonna do this right here that's what i'm feeling at the moment whoever's out here throw me throw me some throw me some suggestions you have like i'll give you 30 seconds to throw me a suggestion if not i'm gonna do this this and this that's what i'm gonna do and we're gonna stick with it that's what i'm gonna do i'm still looking but no that's what this is don't forget this is a cream and that's the one that when i put it on it kind of went on green instead of instead of orange it was that first shade the very first one it looks gold, but on here it looks orange. Isn't that crazy? I'm telling you. So that's what I'm going to do. We're going to do that. And I think I might use her mirror. I think I might. So it has a nice cover on it. Do I take the cover off? No, I won't. I'm that girl. I leave stuff in boxes. I leave covers on. I just do that. Like my car still has the cover on the radio from when I bought it. I've got issues. But all right. So we're going to go into Polaris first. And then, nope, we're not. We're going to go into Spacesuit first, which is the the orangey kind of one. Going to the purple one. All I saw you say was purple, Nelly, and I'm gonna use purple. I sure am. You know me, I like me some purple. So I'm gonna be dangerous and I'm gonna take off the, the little plastic just because it's too, uh, too filmy, okay? You know what I'm saying? It's too filmy. Does that make any sense? It wasn't clear enough, so now I can see my, my messed up face better. Now I can see it better. All right, get off me, guy. Okay, so we're gonna go into spacesuit, which is that one on the bottom. Very, very creamy. Now, I'm not sure if I should use my fingers or if I should use a brush, but I'm gonna use brush. And let's just throw that on real quick. Try to do a quick look for you guys. Maybe I'll put some um, Instagram photos up and take more time, you know, and do more intricate type of looks to give her, you know, a good review. But right now, just on here when we're live, just want to get the color on there just so you can see what it is. This is gorgeous. This just goes from orange to gold, kind of green. Just gorgeous. You guys cannot see it out there. I mean, it's not fair. It's not. You should be sitting in here. But if you were, that means I'd have like 10,000 people in my room and we can't fit like that. It'd be like a fire hazard. So you have to stay out there. But you're missing out because this looks perfect in person. And I'm just using a regular brush, nothing special. This is one of those Glam Mirror, Glam Meyer, Glam, whatever you want to call them. I got in BoxyCharm. I don't know why I gravitate to this brush. It's like my best friend, you know, it really is. Just a simple little brush, you know, just a little shader brush. But I like it so much. I use it for everything. Watch, is going to crap out of me pretty soon because that's what anything I like, you know, whatever I love so much and I give it attention and I adore it, it either craps out on me or... They don't sell it anymore or just something wonderful like that, you know? That's my look. So I'm just loving how this cream is going on. I just want to get a good little base down. All over the bottom lid. Very, very creamy. It's very creamy and luscious. And I think her favorite word to use is like delicious. These are delicious kind of shades. They are. Vanessa, if you're watching, it's delicious. Okay. Just had to do that. Had to do that. All right. So we got the little base down. I'm going to just, just for, just for hoots and giggles. Okay. I don't want to swear. I try not to. I do it all day long. So I try not to on film. Um, but I'm going to just use my finger and just, gosh, it's so creamy. You can even see that. Look at that. See how it's it lifts up because it's so creamy? I want to see if it does any difference using the finger. So yeah, it is more intense when you use the finger. And that's because the warmth of your of your dehydrated little finger, okay, um, helps to grab the product. But it did go on with the brush just fine. It's just the warmth really helps it stand out better.
All right, next shade we're going to go into, let's just wipe it on the pajamas. Everything's going on the pajamas today, you guys. These pajamas are not going to be well. I'm so sorry to do this to you guys. All right, next one I'm going to use is, let's go into, that's so pretty, you guys. Oh, my goodness. We're going to go into Solar Rain and just kind of put Solar Rain just over the top. Still using the same little brush, just kind of get some off. Get some off. That's all we got to do. I should add some music in here. I love to put makeup on and jam out to music. You know, it just kind of like gives you a little, a little vibe. So she calls these light work and that is the perfect name for these because it's just like you're bringing in all of the light, you know, you're just bouncing it right off of your face and it's not painful. Just bouncing all that light off and it's just, it's really giving a beautiful effect. I mean, look at that. You have like a shift of green in there. It's just, oh my goodness. That's all I can say. That's all I can say and that's solar rain. It looks so plain in, in the pan, but when you put it out, it's deceiving because you pull it out and put it on your face. That don't sound right. Let's readjust those words. When you pull it out and forget it. When you slap it on the face, does that sound better? It just gives a whole different life to it. The innuendos on this channel are just, they're there every, every episode. All right, just gorgeous. Thank you, Nelly. It does look really nice. I mean, I'm trying, the reason I keep turning my head is not because I have like an issue, okay? I'm not a bobble head, but I'm just doing this just so you guys can try to get the full effect how it goes from green to this kind of, mm, kind of gold, you know? It just goes from like green to gold. <laughs> Nelly, you're gonna, my, my purpose on this channel is to make you laugh. It's to make you laugh and to bring you some beauty at the same time. So if you're laughing, Nelly, I've done my job. All right, so now underneath, I'm gonna pop in that purple, which is this Aurora right here. That is one of those names that it just tricks the tongue. You know what I'm saying? Again, just never mind me. Um, but I think what I'm gonna use for Miss Aurora is this brush right here, my Sigma. And let's see how that works. And so you can see the purple, but again, it has like a green shift. So a lot of these have like the initial color and then a green shift to it. I mean, I feel like I'm outer spacey. Yeah. Is outer spacey a word? No, it's not. I use a lot of non-words on this channel. Have you subscribed yet? Great segue. Subscribe because you're going to find out words that are not actually in the dictionary. Like outer spacey. Okay? All right. So I'm loving the purple with the shift to it. Just so pretty. Let me know what you guys think on the comments below. I can't stop doing this. I just, I can't stop it because I want you to see, I just want you to see how it looks. Just gonna kind of pull it up a little bit. And this is available at Sephora right now. Just so you guys know, I looked it up before I got on here, okay? So first it was only available on her website. And now this is at Sephora. So that's also amazing. So I'm just kind of like pulling it in here. Hope you guys can see that. The shiftiness going on in here 
It's quite amazing. It really is. Okay, so that's three shades used so far. I think the next shade I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use one more. Hey, Carrie, you made it. We're doing the Danessa Myricks Lightwork 3, and it is gorgeous. I mean, it is just out of this world. And that was the point. She wanted to be out of this world, and she knocked it out of the park. Thank you, Nelly. You're such a sweetheart. So I think I'm gonna try one more shade on here. Um, I've done the three. I've done the, the space suit as the first one. This is the Aurora that I just finished putting underneath. And then I did this one right here, the uh, solar, solar Rain on top. So one more thing I can fit in here is going to be, mm, what do I want to do? What do I want to do, you guys? I want to do one more. Let's try, let's try Mr. Galaxy right down here. Galaxy right here. Let's just try him in the, in the center. Why not? I mean, just why not? We're just playing around. It's going to wash off, okay? Such a creamy shade. It's just beautiful. It's just, oh, it's sickening how beautiful it is. Is that a thing? Well, it is here. Okay, all right. So it's just, what's happening is, while I'm looking at it in my mirror, it has a really nice, beautiful tone to it. But I'm looking at it in here, it's not showing that tone. It's just showing kind of like dark. So that's kind of a bummer. It's a bummer because what I see here and what you're seeing out there, oh, I just dropped something. It's just not the same, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm looking at it here and it just looks, it almost looks like a charcoal color, but it really isn't. It really isn't a charcoal color. So let me try to... Let me try to rectify that just so it looks better for you guys out there because you can't get the you can't get the full effect. You know what I'm saying? You're not getting the effect of what it should be getting. I might have to just like take a picture because it's it's they're so shifty that you just can't tell. So I'm going to pop that first shade back on top. There we go. Just because I felt like it was destroying the look, but not in a bad way, just for you guys in here. It just looks so pretty. It just does but it's not working for, for camera purposes. So we just went back into the first shade, which was the one right here. What do you call it again, guy? Space suit, and just kind of covered it back up. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do, since they have so much of a chromatic type of deal going on, I'm gonna just leave it the way it is right now. And I'm going to use one of these highlights right here for the inner corner, okay, all right. So let's get a different brush. I'm a little bummed because I wanted to put a few more shades on, but they're just kind of clashing in the camera. And we have those problems when we're live sometimes, you know? But if I just took like a regular picture from like a certain angle, it'll work better that way. So I'm looking for my little pencil brush and I can't find him. Of course not because I'm live. And when I'm live, I can't find what I need. Mm -mm. Wouldn't be that easy for me. So I'm going to use this little tiny baby brush right here. This is by the Ariel Collection with Morphe. Very nice brushes, just so you know. And I think what I want to go into, since I have this peachy, chromatic, purpley deal going on, I'm going to try to stick with the, the plain Jane one, which is this one right here. And when I say plain Jane, it's not plain Jane by any means, but it just doesn't have the undertones like pinky and bluey and all that. Okay, there we go. Pop that baby right on there. Oh, I hope that's coming through. It's very icy and very pretty. And that is a golden eclipse. Now this definitely deserves lashes, but I don't have any right now. I don't have any lashes in front of me, so I'm sorry. I'm failing you, but that's okay. Like I said, I'll do some Instagram looks with it and I'll do it some more justice. Just wanted to put a little look together just so you guys can see how how the, the shades perform and how they look. That is a really, really intense and beautiful highlight. 
Dare I try any on the cheeks? I don't know. I'm going to try it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to dabble in it. Uh, we're going to try the the Strawberry Moon right here. So I'm just going to go like that. Just just right there. That's it. Just going to use my finger. And let's see. Right there. Do the same thing over here. Right there. And you can see that strawberry kind of color in there. You really can. And what I'm going to do now is get one of my brushes right here. And just see if I can, well, you don't want to blend out from with the brush. Probably because I don't have any powder on. All I have on is just cream products right now. So since it's not powdered down, it's not like spreading for me. Just use the warmth of my fingers and there we go. And that's the purpose of doing these lives is so you can see how to use the products for yourself. So um, obviously, if you have cream products down, use the warmth of your finger to spread it out and don't trust the brush. Now, if you have powder on, like most people do, I'm not a powdery kind of gal. You know this about me. I don't like to put so much powder because I don't want to accentuate any wrinkles and lines. We don't want to do that. So there we go. Such a beautiful highlight. Very intense, very bam in your face. And like I said, I don't really want to be bam in your face with the cheek area just because of my texture. But it is beautiful. I mean, just look at that highlight. So doggone stinking pretty. It really is. So now I'm going to go ahead and throw in a liner because we have to have eyeliner. If you don't know me, now you know. I need to have eyeliner. It is very rare you'll catch this gal right here with no liner on. And I'm going to use a hand dash. The hero line I was gonna use my Huda Beauty but she's not on my desk right now but that Huda lifeliner is just like this one very nice and uh, I kind of used her all up so she probably don't have no life left in her right now so let's just go ahead and pop some of this on how are we doing tonight you guys Are we loving Danessa's products? I hope you love them as much as I do. I'm her hype gal. You know, I'm here for her. And only because I just love what she creates, you know? I love what she creates. I feel she's very original. And her products just work. And especially her Vision Flush. Those are my favorite. They just blend right out. You can blend them with a brush, your fingers, whatever you want. They just, they just glide. They just glide right on and just blend right in. I want to make sure I don't miss anybody talking. If I did, my apologies. All right, so this is the, again, the Hendash Hero line. super duper nice so i feel like i feel like the tanessa products is kind of going into the eyeliner and it's actually giving it a really nice like chromatic effect which i'm here for it what are we thinking you guys let me know out there Okay, so that's it for the eyeliner. 
did a pretty good job. I could have winged it out a little bit further, but why? Why mess up a nice, beautiful shadow, you know? Last but not least, we're going to pop in some mascara. Mm-hmm. We're going to do that. Wish I had my falsies up here, but I don't, you guys. I'm so sorry. Just so sorry. And we're going to use that Ilia. This is the... Um, this is the wrong one. I didn't mean to buy this one. But it's the Fullest Volumizing Mascara right here. The one I meant to buy, you guys. I mean, I'm so mad at myself. That's what I get for shopping at 3 in the morning. But it was this one. So you see there are two different shades, okay? Right? That's first off. I should have noticed that. Did I notice it? No, because my eyes lie to me. But yeah, this is white and this one's kind of this creamy color. And the one I wanted was the Limitless. This one's called Limitless Lash Mascara. This mascara, just to show you guys... There's really nothing in it, but it's, I keep it on hand to show you guys the difference. It's all about this brush. This brush has little prickly parts to it, you know? Can you see it right there? It's like a little comb. Hi there, how are you? And it just gets through my lashes beautifully. And it just lengthens, 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 lengthens them. There we go. Yeah, I was going to spit it out eventually. Take me another 30 minutes just to say that. And this one is those big old fat ones. Mm-hmm. We don't like those on this channel. Just saying. So, I'm going to use it anyway. Because it, it works. It does a good job. Ilya is a really nice brand. I'm not going to complain. Even though I just complained right now. I just did it. But I'm not going to complain anymore. But I do like it. Um, I just wish that this wand wasn't so fat. It's like a Christmas tree. I don't like the Christmas tree ones. The other one is that... Um, what's that cult favorite? Everyone loves it. Everyone in their mother loves it. The uh, Better Than Sex one. Yeah, I think that's a Too Faced. Everybody loves that mascara, and I don't. I dislike it with the passion. But it's okay. This one does give you some volume. I just hate how thick it is because I feel like it's going to hit the roof. The roof is on fire with this. All right, that kind of pulled the look together. This one looks bald. This one doesn't. Hi, how are you? The differences. And I like to do this like wiggle wiggle and this twist. I like to twist it. Just to try to get everything in there. Carrie, you hit your kids all the time with brushes that are too big. <laughs> Carrie, that sounds like my my childhood growing up. I can relate. So again, I really wish I had a nice set of lashes for this look because I feel like it needs it, you know? Sometimes a good lash just pulls a great look together. You know what I'm saying? And I don't like wearing lashes all day, every day because for one, it pulls out my eyelashes. My eyelashes start to hate me. They start to hate me and they start to you know, misbehave and start to fall out because they don't like that I'm putting fake ones on top of them. They're like babies. They start crying. They start falling. They're just being dramatic. So I try not to wear false lashes um, too often, but for a nice look like this, it kind of needs it. It kind of needs it to pull it together and give it the oomph that it deserves, okay? And Danessa, she, she deserves some oomph. She really does. One of these days, I'm going to have Vanessa on my channel. Mark my words. Okay? I might be 100, but I don't care. I don't care. I'm going to have her on my channel. And we're going to have some tea time. And we're going to talk about these awesome shadows. All right. That's about it. I can't really do much more. Again, the reason I'm being very cautious is because I'm going to hit the top of my lid. And we don't want to do that. We're live. Okay? It's very hard to fix mascara mistakes when you're live. Are they fixable? Of course they are. Do you want to do that? No. So I hope you guys were able to get the idea of this beautiful light work palette. Again, I'm not paid to say any of this. Um, nobody knows me, okay? Nobody knows me to pay me to say anything. And even if they did pay me, rest assured that I will always, always give my honest opinion whether I like it or not. If I don't like it, I'm gonna let you know. But just so far, I just like everything she puts out. I really do. Even those chrome flakes, they're not the easiest to work with because they do kind of slip and slide around a little bit. But if you're patient and you let them dry down a little bit, um, that's the review I did a couple weeks ago, or no, one week ago. 
It's very Maya and me. I don't know who that is, but hi. It's Brian, Maya, and Lee. Hmm. Are you are you my kids on there using another name? I have no idea. It's Liara. Oh, okay. They're in the room. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? How do you like the look? Is it cute? Do you like it? Does it does it get your approval? I hope so. So you guys, that is the end of the look. Again, this is Danessa Myrix. And if you have not gotten any of her products, go get them. Okay, go get them, go try them, and then love them. Love them, like them, and leave me a comment about them. All right? So um, that's all I got for you guys today. Hey, girls. Hey. Um, have a great night, you guys. Like I always say to everybody, every single video, be kind. Okay? It doesn't cost anything to go out there and be nice to people. Don't slam doors in their face. Don't punch holes in things. And don't throw shopping carts around because you're going to hit someone's car. And when you do that, you cause dents. And then what happens? No one's nice after that. Okay? All right. So there's a lecture for you guys. All right, love y'all. Have a great night. And I hope you guys enjoyed Miss Danessa's Lightwork 3 palette. Go get one. All right, bye. Bye.